cause of zoonotic disease is exhibition. Zoonoses have developed in human beings by the interaction with animals at the fairs, petting zoos and other settings. Hunting, the practice of killing or trapping animal brings human beings in close contact with animals. Example, HIV infection emerged from chimpanzees in West Africa. Factors which are responsible for emergence of zoonotic diseases. It include first introduction of a new host species into an ecosystem. Second, introduction of in, an infected host into a new ecosystem like the emergence of Marburg disease. Third, changes in population dynamics. Fourth, ecological changes that bring two previously separated ecosystems into contact like trypanosomiasis. Fifth, changes in habits including the food habits. Sixth, technical changes which, which are brought by human beings. Seven, mutation or genetic recombination of infectious agents. It, this include influenza infection. Then coming to the zoonosis caused by bac in bacterial infection. First, animal bites. Animal bites, particularly of cats and dogs, cause the bacterial infection and the most common zoonotic disease. There are numerous species of dangerous bacteria like Pasturella multocida are present in the mouth of dogs and cats. Bacteria enter deep into skin with a penetrating bite and causing infection which results in pain, swelling and inflammation. All animal bites should be taken seriously and medication is given when skin is damaged. Next disease is anthrax. Bacteria bacillus anthracis is the causative agent of an acute disease and it is a serious zoonosis infection. This occurs in human beings with direct contact of infected animals, mostly cattle or indirect contact with highly contaminated soil. Mostly people like kinakuri workers, veterinarians and farmers who work with dyed animals are at more risk of developing this disease. Work related exposure can also happen through animal products like contaminated wool or hides and more than 90% of cases of this disease are associated with the work related exposure can also happen through animal products like contaminated wool or hides. And more than 90% cases of this disease are associated with this. Initially, the lesion is present as an itchy, painless papule, which leads to ulceration and advances to a black necrotic ishar. Infection of gastrointestinal tracts and lungs are rarely involved. If it occurs, become more serious and really often fatal. Then next disease is brucellosis. Bovine brucellosis is another severe zoonotic infection. Brucella arbotus is causative agent. Brucella suis is another bacterial species which causes this infection. This, transmit, this disease is transmitted from pigs and results into an, a severe flu-like symptoms like running nose, 
fever, coughing, etc. Then cat scratch fever. Bartonella hensley is a causative agent of this disease, which was identified in 1992. There are other Bartonella species are also reported that causes similar disease syndromes. Bacteria are transferred with a cat scratch or cat bite. Firstly, pustules and papules are formed around the infection site. This infection advances with stopping of the healing of a wound that leads to swelling of lymph nodes and finally abscession. Generally, public like veterinarian live with large number of cats are more at risk of this disease. Then, leptospirosis. Inhalation of bacteria is responsible for this disease. Bacteria are present in aerosols of urine droplets. Infection is transmitted by direct contact with bacteria from the urine. People like dairy farmers, piggery workers and stock transport transporters are at risk for infection. Now vaccines are available for dairy animals and other milking cattle must be vaccinated for the protection of both the cattle and farm workers. An infected person usually suffers from acute onset of headache, fever, conjunctivitis, vomiting ab and abdominal pain. Infected animals might be asymptomatic car carrier or show symptoms of like jaundice, blood, Tinged urine and death. Then coming to listeriosis. Listeria monocytogenes is a common disease of ruminants causing encephalitis, septicemia, and abortion or mastitis. This infection spread by intake of contaminated food, often fodder. It can also spread by the wounds. Conjunctiva conjunctivitis and upper respiratory tract a uh, mucosa layer. It mainly a food borne disease which is caused by consumption of meats, vegetables, milk and cheese products. This agent can tolerate low temperature also and survive for a longer time in cold storage. Flu-like symptoms are present in humans and are more seriously resulted in abortion, prepartum meningoencephalitis and death resulted due to infection in neonates. Next is mycobacterium infectious non-tuberculosis. Some mycobacterium species can also cause zoonotic disease. Tank granuloma is the zoonotic disease caused by mycobacterium marinum in aquarium fishes and transmit to humans generally resulting in skin lesion which leads to ulcers. It generally requires direct contact with the infected fish and tank. Granulomatous disease in birds and rarely it present in pigs, which is caused by mycobacterium avium intracellular MAC, though a human infection is exceptional. This results in disease of swollen glands in children and distributed to people suffering from AIDS. Subspecies of Mycobacterium avium are also known as Mycobacterium avium subspecies 
paratuberculosis which causes jaundice disease in sheep and cattle and a probable reason of human crohn's disease next is pistachiosis disease this is caused by chlamydophilia pistachii birds are responsible for transmission of this disease to human beings inhalation of dust contaminated with fecal matter of bird generally causes infection Hu immune suppressed people are more prone to this infection q fever the bacterium called coxella burnetti is an agent of the disease called q fever severe flu like symptoms is present which might last for some time some months this bacterium spread by inhalation of placental fluids and an animal excreta no symptoms are seen in infected animals people like veterinarian abattoir workers dealing with fetuses farm workers and shearers are more at risk of coming in direct contact with disease salmonellosis livestock poultry and reptiles are carrier animals of bacteria salmonella which resides in their intestinal tract infectious bacteria are present in the faces of these animals which being yarded and transmitted humans and other animals can come into contact with the salmonella bacteria through contaminated fecal matter this infection result in gastroenteritis next uh, disease which is caused by bacteria is streptococcus suis bacterial infection this infection is carried by pigs which may be appear healthy humans are infected more, most often through skin wounds or rarely by inhalation the disease caused can include meningitis and may be fatal good stock management to eliminate the agent in the herd and comprehensive personal hygiene is very important in preventing this infection now coming to the zoonotic infections caused by protozoa first cryptosporidiosis a protozoan found in the gut of livestock animals like lamb calves goats etc this is responsible for cryptosporidiosis disease direct contact with dung drinking of infected water or swimming in infected water transmitted the infection to human beings immune suppressed people and children are more prone to this disease flu like symptoms observed a person which last up to 6 weeks with diarrhea and abdominal pain this infection can be incurable next protozoan disease is giardia giardia disease is caused by a flagellate protozoan called giardia intestinalis on or giardia duodenalis this agent resides in the intestine of household and wild animals the infection causes diarrhea intake of contaminated water is responsible for infection in human beings as well as in animals giardia species can also survive at low temperature and in chlorinated environment giardia can also be transmitted through direct contact of infected animals like cats and dogs next is toxoplasmosis this is caused by protozoa 
known as Toxoplasma gondii. Humans get infection sick after coming in contact with fecal matter of domestic cats. Infection in cats occurs by eating birds, rodents or raw meat containing this parasite. Then excreta of infected cat contain an infected infective stage of the parasite. Immune suppressed people like, uh, uh, like aged people or people uh, on immunosuppressive drugs, women during the initial days of pregnancy or AIDS people are more at risk to get the infection of Toxoplasma gondii. Next is zoonosis caused by fungi. This includes one disease, dermatophysis or ringworm. Ringworm is a fungal infection of the skin in men and animals. Red ringed appearance on the skin, so this is known as ringworm. But due to caused by worm, but do not cause by worms. This infection is very common in children which easily develop it from people of any age. Direct contact with fungi or fungal spores is responsible for the infection. Animals having skin lesions should be handled with care. Infected human beings may transmit this disease to their pet animals. Next disease is caused by parasites. This include hydrated disease, echinococcus granulosis, a small tapeworm which is causative agent of hydrated disease. Worm resides in the small intestine of animals. This is transmitted infection within dogs through an intermediate host like sheep and kangaroos. Sheep consume eggs from grazing land infected with fecal matter of dog. Eggs hatch in their body and leads to the formation of cyst. Tapeworm completes its life cycle in the dog. In case of human beings, large cysts are seen in organs like liver. Intake of eggs from the fecal matter of dog is responsible for the development of infection in human beings. Next disease is vis vis visceral larval migraines. It is an infection caused by a parasite which mainly affects children. The causative agent of this disease is a nematode called Toxocara canis or Toxocara cati. Nematode resides in the intestinal tract of pet animals like dogs and cats. It is transmitted to kids when they involuntarily eat the fecal mat matter of dog or cat which is contaminated with the eggs of worm. Eggs of the worm are also present on the coat of pet animals. When animals are petted, eggs may be transferred to the hands and reaches the mouth. Eggs hatch inside the intestine and migrate to other body parts and cause the formation of internal lesions. In some cases, the worms are able to migrate into an artery of eye and block the supply of blood to the retina and this leads to the temporary or permanent blindness. Next zoonotic infec uh, infections caused by viruses. This include Hendra, Nipah and Menangle virus infections. Flying foxes, fruit bats, it's as a reservoir of these viruses. They are recently placed in paramyxovirus category. 
Nipah virus is responsible for illness in pigs and then to human beings, which results into deadly encephalitis. Meningeal virus also causes infection in pigs and piggery workers, but Hendra virus causes a serious respiratory disease of the horse. This virus spreads from horse to human through close contact. In humans, it causes respiratory syndrome and encephalitis. Next, viral diseases caused by Lysa virus and rabies virus. Lysa virus is present in bat and belongs to the same group of rabies viruses. In 1996, this virus was identified in black flying fox in New South Wales. Large bats or flying foxes or very small bats or insect eating bats are carrier of this virus and spread this disease to human beings. Rabies infection is present throughout the world. The main reservoir of this infection is foxes, wolves, mongoose, skunks and vampire bats. Usually transmission of infection occurs as a result of a bite from an infected animal. Then other diseases or this is a common disease of sheep caused by a pox virus. Vaccination of sheep is the only effective method of prevention from the live virus. Normally, in humans, virus enter from the cut or scratch and reaches to face and the whole body. The lesions are dreadful, protruded, a shabby sore that takes six weeks for healing. Then coming to the zoonosis, caused by worms. First, disease is Ascariasis. This disease is caused by a human parasitic worm Ascaris lumbricoides. It is a parasitic nematode worm and commonly known as round worm. Worms reside in the intestinal tract and feed on digestive food. Round worms are able to grow up to 8 to 12 cm in length. Majority human infections with round worms are unnoticed, but they have the potential to cause severe diseases. Eggs of the worms are infective stage which require 3 to 4 weeks for protruding disease. Once upon reaching the human intestine, eggs hatch into larvae which undergo into maturation and then migrates to other organs like lungs, liver, brain, eyes, etc. Symptoms of Ascariasis include fever, cough and wheezing. Next disease is encyclostomiasis. Causative agent is Encyclostoma duodenale. It is a parasitic nematode worm and commonly known as Old World hookworm. It lives in the small intestine of hosts such as humans, cats and dogs where it is able to mate and mature. It is small and thin which stick to the intestinal walls and sucks blood. This parasite normally infects kittens and puppies. A light infection causes abdominal pain, loss of appetite, but heavy infection causes severe protein deficiency or iron deficiency which results into anemia. Protein deficiency may lead to dry skin, edema, while iron deficiency anemia might result 
into mental dullness and heart failure. Women who are pregnant and infected should be aware that this parasite is able to infect the fetus and cause complications like low birth weight, maternal anemia and infant mortality. In human beings, the larva of hookworm can penetrate through the skin of hands and feet. This is known as cutaneous larval migraines. This causes lesions which are red and itchy. Next disease is teniasis. It is caused by platyhelminth tenia solium or commonly known as tapeworm. The adult tapeworm consists of many small segments known as proglottids which contain eggs, break off the tail end and passed into stool. It involves two hosts, human being and pig. Pig is intermediate host. It is a common parasite of the intestine. Humans can become infected with tapeworms if they ingest the food contaminated with eggs or raw pork. Symptoms of teniasis include intestinal irritation, anemia and indigestion which can lead to loss of appetite and emaciation. Its larval stays cysticercus which is a highly pathogenic and causes cysticerosis in the brain. This can lead to epilepsy, scissors, lesions in the brain, blindness, tumor-like growth and low level of eosinophils. It is the cause of major neurological problems like hydrocephalus, paraplegy, meningitis, convulsions and even death. Now coming to the precautions to prevent zoonotic diseases. First, people should have good personal hygiene. Provide quick and efficient first aid treatment to cuts and scratches of animals. Next, use using personal protective tools like overalls, gloves, boots, goggles and aprons. Workplaces and equipment should be cleaned and disinfected regularly. Proper vaccination of pets and livestock should be done. Entry of rodent should be controlled into houses. Sick animals always kept separately and proper medication should be given on time. Let's summarize the whole topic. Zoonotic diseases are the infectious diseases that are naturally transmitted from vertebrate animals to humans and vice versa. They are caused by all type of pathogenic agents including bacteria, parasites, fungi, viruses, etc. Although they have been recognized for many centuries, their impact on public health has increased in the last few decades due to a combination of the success in reducing the spread of human infectious diseases through vaccination and effective therapies and the emergence of novel zoonotic diseases. People like farmers, kinakari workers, abattoir workers and veterinarians live in close contact with animals are at a higher risk of zoonosis infection. We have to take effective approaches at the human-animal ecosystem interface for proper investigation, prevention and control of any emerging zoonotic disease. Thank you for your attention.